Hey everyone, Saints fan, I'm back again with another GTA 5 video, and today I'll be going over all of the clothing glitches, at least that we know at the moment, after patch 1.37, the import-export update. Now I'm sure there'll be more that come out after this video, and when those do come out, when people do find those, I will make a video letting you guys know, but at the moment, this is all, or these are all the glitches, and ways to get certain parts to fit together, like glasses, hats, masks, and whatever else you may want. Now, funny enough, there's Rockstar finally listened to us. They actually gave us the ability to wear some of these options together. And a few of those that you don't need to glitch anymore, I figured I would talk about them in this video. So certain masks can be worn with pretty much every single helmet, like the ski masks and some of the helmet or some of the masks that you would think would fit underneath a, a helmet. You can wear those legitly now. Like all you have to do is put on a mask, go to the clothing store and then scroll through the helmet options and it even works with bulletproof helmets. So that's really awesome. You don't have to glitch that at least too much now. You can also wear a hazmat mask like they have that the the gas mask that comes with the hazmat suit. They have that in the mask shop. I'm not entirely sure why that's there because from when I looked at it, you couldn't really equip it with any outfit apart from the hazmat outfit that it comes with. But it is there, and you can, like the other masks, put on a helmet above that, like over it. One thing you can do is the traditional telescope glitch to actually get the the hazmat mask by itself. I believe that still works. But the other thing that you can do completely legitly now, is that even a word? I don't know. Is you can change the hats and the glasses, or at least some of the hats, on the face bandana mask. So now, when you equip that face bandana mask, you can scroll through any of the glasses even the new ski masks and the goggles, and it will equip them. Also, what's kind of cool, and I found this out, you can't put on any hat, but any of the hats that are like sideways crooked, you can put those on, and some of these special ones will actually glitch the hoodie up on top of it. So you can have a hoodie up with the hat on, with the glasses on, or a, a, ski, mat, or a ski goggles on with the face bandana. So you can have a lot going on if you wanted to do that. Now, I don't know if there'll be another glitch you know, down the line that where people figure out how to put any hat, I guess, on, you know, any face bandana because they actually patched the, the method of going into a mission. If you go into a mission with a face bandana on, it will leave the helmet or the hat and the glasses on where before it would have just a face bandana. So I'm sure someone will find a new method for that. Now, as for the glitches, the same telescope glitch still works, whether if you, whether you want to do it in your apartment or on the pier, I always do the one on the pier because I hate loading screens and I hate going into the apartment. So if you go to the pier, what you can do is if you're wearing glasses, because it only works with glasses, I'll get into how you can put hats on here in a second, but wear your glasses with whatever outfit, save that, and then switch your mask to whatever mask you want. You go to the telescope, light yourself on fire in whatever way that you want. Right before you catch on fire, hit right on the D-pad. So you go into the telescope, it'll remove the mask, and then you catch on fire. It'll remove you from the telescope, simply move out of the fire, switch to your outfit with the glasses that you have saved, walk away, and now you will have a mask, whatever mask you chose, with whatever glasses you saved. Now, this method doesn't actually work with helmets or hats anymore, so it's kind of unfortunate there, but if you do want to wear a hat with that combination you just made, go ahead and save that combination, and then go ahead and choose whatever hat you want, for the gameplay, I think I'm going to choose a white beanie, and what you see I'm wearing is a ski mask and I believe the ski goggles. And what you do here is the bike glitch, the one that's been working for a long time. You get on the bike with the hat on, wait till your guy puts the helmet on, then you get off the bike, and right as your guy takes off the helmet, you quickly switch back to the outfit that you had saved with the mask and glasses, and now you can go and save that and you'll have the mask glasses and hat it's kind of unfortunate we had to do two glitches now when before we only had to do one but a hey, at least it still works so that's a good thing if you want to wear a mask and glasses with a helmet like i said most of them you can just go into the clothing store and change it to i mean you can see i have the glitch with the that you know ski mask and then the goggles on and i can put any helmet on but the problem is some of the masks you cannot actually wear with a helmet and that's where you're gonna have to do another glitch which i'll get into in a second before i get into that one though for the CEO outfits, the same glitch still applies. To save CEO outfits, if you want the Warlord pants, what you have to do is equip them, like become a CEO, equip them, then go into a survival, 
I did the peer survival. I don't know if it matters, but just do a survival. Once you're in the survival, the minute you get in, go to your interaction menu, go to the visor down and visor up options, scroll through that for like 10 seconds or so. Basically, my rule of thumb is when they start shooting me, that's when I back out of the interaction menu and then go to my phone and quit the mission. Once you get back into free room, you should be wearing that outfit and you're still a CEO. From here, get on a bike or get on a, or, you know, get in a car, whatever, go to ammunition. Once you're inside ammunition, retire as a CEO. You'll still be wearing that that outfit, whatever one you chose, and then you can save it from here, and then you can go and customize it in the clothing store. So the CEO outfit still works, and also the pilot headset outfit or the pilot headset glitch still works. All you need to do is own a yacht and get in a helicopter where you put on the pilot headset, just land in the hot tub, your guy will be wearing his hot tub clothes, get out of the helicopter, walk away, and you should have the pilot headset with whatever original outfit you had on from there you have to actually go to an ammunition or a clothing store to save because i don't believe if you go inside of your yacht i don't believe it will work they patched that last time so i would just say get in a boat or whatever and then drive to an ammunition to save the outfit that's how you get the pilot headset this next one is a new glitch this one is how to wear any mask with a hoodie up and to do this step one is to buy any new hoodie that goes up when wearing a hat and then equip whatever mask you want with that hoodie and go ahead and save the outfit. Next up, go ahead and equip a hat that does make the hoodie go up. I don't think the hat really matters, but just equip the hat, whatever hat you want that makes the hoodie go up. Next, open the interaction menu and highlight the outfit that you want the hood up on. That'll be the one we just saved. Then once you have that in the slot, hover over the parachute option and enter a car. This is where it's gonna get a little tricky because you do have to time it right, but Basically, right as your guy's about to close the door, hit A and switch to the outfit you had saved. And once you get out, you'll notice, as you see, I am wearing a zebra mask with the hoodie up. I, there might even be a hat on, but it's pretty funny. I mean, with the, the, mask, the horse masks look pretty funny when you wear a hat and when you have the hoodie up. But any other mask this will work with. I'm sure people will find ways to make awesome outfits using some of this stuff. But yeah, if you wanted the hoodie up with any of the new masks or any of the, of the masks in general... That is a pretty simple way. It does take some timing, some getting used to. You might have to do it a few times, but as long as you switch to the outfit right as your guy is closing the door, I guess, then you should have the that glitch saved. And then the last one we're going to do is how to wear a mask, like any mask with any helmet. This one is going to apply to like the, the horse mask. That's the one we're going to try. It applies to any of the other masks that you can't glitch legitly now. So... First thing to do, we're going to go to an ammunition. This one is a little tricky, but go to an ammunition and then we're going to go to style. Make sure, well, first off, make sure you have an outfit saved with a helmet or with a mask on. I have an outfit. It's outfit number zero with a horse mask. So save that. Then what we're going to do is go down to the bike helmet. And obviously, once you're off the bike, go ahead and pick whatever helmet you want. We're going to try with the, the biker dome. Uh, but, or the black dome, but I think this works with any helmet. Then, obviously, we're going to get on. Make sure you're not wearing the outfit with the mask because your guy won't put on the helmet. So make sure he puts on the helmet. Then we're going to go back, hover over the parachute option. And the way this works, you have to time it perfectly. So I might not be able to get it on the first try, but you hit triangle to get off. Walk in here. You hit X, and then you hit circle, circle in like four seconds or so, and then it should glitch everything on together but let's go ahead and try it so i'm gonna hit triangle we're gonna hit down go in hit x and sir okay nope that didn't work at all let's uh go ahead and try that again i completely just failed there all right so we're gonna do it again again we're gonna hover over parachute we're on the motorcycle with our helmet on i need these guys to get out the way so we're gonna hit triangle hit down walk in hit x and then nope it didn't do it again all right so i was too fast so you got to do it again it is sort of tricky it's just kind of unfortunate that we got to do all of this just to get through the, or just to get a helmet and, you know, the glasses or whatever together. But we're going to go ahead and take it off. Try it one more time. Hopefully this one works. Wait till your guy puts on the helmet. Get off. Walk in. Right as he's taking it off. We're gonna, oh, man. We almost got it. We almost got it. You have to wait till the guy takes the helmet off. It is really tricky, though. So, all right, well, I, I can't get it to work, but basically you do that 
I'll go ahead and show a picture of you know what the outcome will be in a second. But your guy will have his helmet in his hand. Like you'll see the helmet in your hand. And if you have that helmet in your hand, all you have to do is hit square or X, whatever you're on, and then save it over the outfit you you know originally had. And then in the end, you'll have you know a horse mask with a helmet with whatever else you already you know included. Again, I'm sorry that I can't do it on PC. It is a tricky glitch, so I don't know if it's going to be worth it for many people, but, I, and also, I don't know if it works. Maybe it doesn't work on PC, but it still works on console. I don't know. I know it does work because I, I've seen a lot of videos. I've seen a lot of people, uh, you know, posting pictures of it and all that, so it does work. I don't know if I just, I can't do it right or what, but I think that is all the glitches that we have at the moment. I mean, if there's any other ones that you guys know of that I didn't include in this video, just let, them, let everyone know in the comment section. Fashion Friday will be out later on. We have a bunch of really awesome outfits. I, uh, I'm really liking this DLC in terms of clothing and, and really just a lot of stuff. I mean, apart from the prices, I think this has been a, one of the best DLCs they've ever added. But also one thing I forgot, the police glitch, they actually patched that. So now when you go into you know any of the missions where you can get a police outfit and then you AFK, when you get back into free roam, it will actually put you in a random outfit. So it's really weird. I don't know, again, you know why Rockstar does this stuff. Although one, one of my friends said this method, it doesn't work, I don't believe, for the P, the police glitches, but it still works for you know the garbage man glitches, it, it works for even the new turf mode, because you can get black joggers, which is a pretty rare clothing item, which you can do, and this is only on the PS4, I don't know if there's something similar on the Xbox One, and obviously it doesn't work on the PC, but if you're on the PS4, this is the instructions that he gave, you can see on screen, maybe if you want to try that to get you know any of those glitched mission outfits you can try it and let me know if it does work for you but thank you all for watching that is it see you all in the next one drop a like if you did enjoy subscribe for more awesome gta content and as always i will see you guys in the next one